Okay, so just to reflect on illness and uh, recurring asthma coming back again, potentially due to allergies or um, anxiety. Um, and my views on illness um, as well. And from uh, Dr. Hawkins' teachings, you know, I, got, I went to meet uh, Dr. Hawkins in Sedona and I had gout and I knew he had gout and he'd recovered from gout. And, um, and he told me, he said a few things to me, which I remember and reflected on quite strongly. One was that um, the, uh, he had had that and the secret spiritual message in gout was that he had to pray for forgiveness for the one in him. Uh, that inflicted pain on others in this lifetime and others. I'm just looking at his work, this thing of guilt. You know, if I've got unprocessed guilt within me, uh, guilt by its nature and all the negative emotions are, are you know, the symbolic message in guilt is uh, I require some form of punishment. So I, I sort of saw that uh, all the self-hatred and the guilt uh, and shame that I had in me had somehow latched on to, I had asthma as well later on, to gout, asthma, kidney failure. And the messages came in from the universe how, um, you know, on what I needed to do to release them with Hawkins, feel the feelings, feel the illnesses out. And also this thing which he shared, which was that if you do all the spiritual work, feel the feelings, cancel the beliefs, or do whatever spiritual work until the illness is going, you can also take it back again if you're not vigilant. Um, and also, even if you can't remember believing the thing, you have taken it on, either in early childhood, it's a belief that's part, you can't express something which is not held in mind. So somehow it's been taken from the collective at some point, either in childhood or a past life. Often with illnesses, um, uh, it can be that they can come back again if you believe it or accumulate uh, negative feelings or guilt, or if uh, the situation becomes difficult. Like I'm sure with the coronavirus crisis, uh, just and all the stresses and pressures, uh, it can lead to uh, accumulation of uh, negative feelings, anxiety, anxious thoughts, and therefore the immunity to being in those higher vibrations where there's an immunity to believing or to letting any be beliefs express themselves of illness um, or, the, or repressed feelings uh, where you're immune to these illnesses. So it's almost like as your level of consciousness goes down, if there's anxiety, stress or difficulties, uh, then uh, that can then bring a recurrence or you can just take on the belief again. Hawkins once described with um, hypoglycemia, how he'd cancel the beliefs and let go of the feelings and he could just eat sugar uh, without any problems, without any shakes, and then started to give lectures on it and then reprogrammed himself into the illness. So for myself uh, with asthma and from, you know, I, this, um, if, if I haven't canceled the belief or let go of the feelings and transcended an illness, or if I go back down and pick up the belief or go down in levels of consciousness, these illnesses and various beliefs from within, you know, from myself or I can pick up from the collective, you know, I could get back a susceptibility to asthma, kidney failure, gout, whatever is a susceptible illness for each individual. As one uh, goes down, or picks up beliefs or drops in levels of consciousness or life gets difficult, then, um, then these things can start flaring up. So then for me, if anything was to flare up, it would be just to do the spiritual work, uh, feeling the feelings, canceling beliefs. Allergies are a belief. So, uh, and a belief, if you have a belief that pollen um, is gonna give you an allergy, it does. And in fact, Hawkins had quite a few allergies um, uh, the allergy to poison ivy, he just cancelled that belief. If you would pick up the poison ivy, he would, you know, he would get a histamine reaction, flare up, uh, it'd be horrific. But I, when he cancelled it, completely cancelled it, and he got a message from spirit that it had been completely done, he could just pick up uh, poison ivy and there was no allergy. Uh, that belief within him had been completely cancelled out. And so 
they can be cancelled out, but they can also be picked up again. Um, so vigilance and keeping on top of uh, repressed feelings is uh, necessary. If I get a fl if I was to get a flare up of something, I would just uh, sit through the feelings and uh, just cancel uh, any beliefs uh, that I I would uh, intuit are coming up around it, from physical symptoms to what might be the underlying belief that all, all the illnesses are just belief systems within the collective of consciousness. So they can be, if there's got a divine permission, they can all be canceled and released. Um, okay, I'm just gonna stop.